What's going on my fellow residents, it's me to Frozen Cavern, and today I am happy to announce that I have some new content coming to the channel. The current stuff that I usually have been doing is for license-based games that release on consoles as well as occasionally handheld titles. However, up until this point, there is one other area that I have yet to touch on, browser games. This is something that I've actually been wanting to do for at least a couple months now, but there's been a good amount of reasons as to why I haven't done it yet. Number one, while there are a good amount of games on browser sites that I'm willing to do, there's a lot from the past that I would like to cover, especially since that's what a lot of my channel is based around. However, I wouldn't be able to because they simply aren't on those sites anymore. This is especially the case for Cartoon Network. Thankfully though, through some researching I found that people have archived some of these browser games and are sharing them on the internet for people to use. Which, I have to say, good on them because Seriously, a lot of those games could have been gone forever, but they managed to keep that from happening. But anyways, this then leads into the second reason. Even if I do have a good amount of games to work with, I would have to find a different way to do reviews for browser games. The main reason being that the games I usually review normally have at least two hours of gameplay as opposed to browser games that last about a half hour at best. Doing a single video on each of these games would really only make a video about 5 minutes, and I don't feel like trying to stretch those games out as long as I can for a single video. So here's how I'm going to do the new series, which I will call Nostalgic Browsing. By the way, I'm using this video as essentially a prototype of how the videos will look, so let me know in the comments how you feel about the layout. For every individual video, I'll be looking at multiple browser games. This will be anywhere between 5 to 8 games per video. I don't really have a set number in stone, to be honest. For each game, I have a maximum time of 2 minutes to talk about it, trying to cover as many important bases as I can. However, I don't need to use the full 2 minutes in every game. Whenever I have leftover time, I add that into storage and can use that extra time for any other game in case I need more time to talk about those games. I think it'll be an interesting way to try and review these by trying to restrain the amount of time I have. It's essentially supposed to be a lot faster, more concise, and get my point across as quickly as I can while still being able to elaborate on anything that I need to. Anyways, in terms of what browser games I would group together in a video, I can try to keep them limited to one series per video, but there will definitely be some times where the collection gets more miscellaneous. Even if they are miscellaneous, I'll group them by networks, Cartoon Network, Nickelodeon, etc. Now, to debut this new series, I'll be doing a video dedicated to Ben 10 browser games. This is to hopefully hold those over that have been waiting for me to do a review for Cosmic Destruction, which, by the way, will be done this summer, or at least I'm hoping, given a lot of stuff that's happened recently. Honestly, who knows what could happen given everything so far. But regardless, I hope you guys are excited for the new content I'll be bringing to you guys, as I've been wanting to do this for a while now. Now, this does not mean that my regular reviews are stopping. That is far from the case. I'm just wanting to add browser games into the collection of reviews that I normally do, as that is also another decently big part of a lot of our childhoods. And for any of you that have an archive of your own of said browser games, try and share them with other people online, because again, a lot of people are wanting to play these games or go back to them at some point, and I'm pretty sure it would mean a lot to those people as well. By the way, down in the comments below, I'm actually going to post a link to a video I've been in with someone else because I collabed on that video for the game Open Season. So in case any of you guys wanted to see my thoughts on that game, make sure you go over to that channel and show some support, as the both of us have worked pretty hard on that video. But until the next video, take care.